Hi, I'm Eddie Wu, and I'm a mathematics teacher. I want you to picture a world where people hate, they loathe learning music because everyone is forced to learn music and they have to memorize all these notes. They have to become very good at coloring in the little notation to try to communicate a piece to someone. They have to memorize all of these uh, pieces and they are tested on how quickly they can regurgitate those pieces. And if you can do it accurately and not miss a note and have all of the right things there, then we'll give you an A and we'll say, you know, very good, you're excellent. Maybe if you keep this up for 10 years, you might actually get to hold a musical instrument or write your own piece once upon a time. If you if you can, you know, survive for that long, can you imagine a world where people thought about music that way rather than as a a creative expression of the human soul that we use to to articulate the way we feel about the things and and, and understand and articulate our experience of the world. That'd be a really sad world to live in. But that is the world we live in right now because that's the way people view mathematics. They view it as something they're forced to do, they don't enjoy, they don't view it as creative or imaginative at all. But it's only if people survive, you know, all of this mandatory schooling that they might actually get to say university and experience mathematics as something that they can, they can invent for themselves and experience in a way that helps them articulate their understanding of the world and it can just make up rules and play. I want the world that our children grow up in to be one where they realize mathematics is a deeply human thing. Uh, it's, it's a sense that we all have, and some people have sharper senses than others. I have terrible eyesight, but that doesn't mean I don't think of seeing as something that's integral to who I am as a human being. I want everyone to think of mathematics as deeply natural to them, as speaking the, the language that comes out of their mouth when they're, when they're just a toddler. Uh, I think that mathematics has the power to help people um, see and appreciate things around them that would be invisible otherwise, and I want them to have access to that and own that for themselves.